when I'm putting out the music, it is going to be considered as reggae or dance up, right? Mm -hmm. But it's just the rapper for me is just a way of life, a way of living. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Knock it in a dem mother face when you play a game Talk while you go dead idiot I don't see if you We hear me call him no bugger talking Cause she's staying in the swamp And the mother does this Cause she's staying in the swamp And the mother does this Wait a minute How, wait, first of all You're not gonna speed past that Like you didn't just say what you just said Me not have no problem with Marshall getting it Or uh, Taurus getting it But I want to understand or the process go off in the side who get out of distinction viewers and subscribers welcome back to another update so we see where byron messiah did a recent interview and it seems like the artist still holding on to the notion that he's not a dancehall artist it seems like the artist more view himself as a rapper even though him say the charts um, place the music, they're gonna place it on the reggae slash dancehall. Him still consider himself as a rapper, so we're going to talk about that. We also see where Skeng still a shooter of a massacre. People, yo, Skeng release a diss track of a massacre. It seems like it's an unreleased song, so we're going to show you, you know, what's going on for that. Also coming up, we see where Foot Type is questioning the government about what are the requirements for, you know persons to get OD which is out of distinction because we see you know Wayne Marshall and Taurus Riley get it and a lot of people is like them are bond them out them are give their opinion you know a lot of people are saying them not deserve it most people are saying Beanie Man and Bunty Killer should have gotten that award instead but before we get into all these topics please remember to leave a like on this video very important also subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed as yet and leave your thoughts down in the comment section you also said that you're actually not a dancehall artist like do you still stand by that are you no so, um, I gl I gl no i'm glad you i'm glad you you, you bring it up right mm -hmm. I'm so happy you bring it up. I don't know why everybody hasn't bring up this since I've said that. Um, uh, the term, the term, the term rapper, how we use the term rapper, right? Mm -hmm. It's not basically meaning like, oh, we do rap music. Mm -hmm. Like We use the term rapper because of the lifestyle we live. Mm -hmm. Understand? You can be a dancehall rapper. Dancehall artist? Because, I mean, that, I mean, we do. At the end of the day, it's it's the re it's the reggae charts that are gonna claim my music. Mm -hmm. um, when I put out the music, it is going to be considered as reggae or dance up, right? Mm -hmm. But it's just the rapper for me is just a way of life, a way of living. Because I mean, check out how back then I used to be walking. You know what I mean? Now we're happening escalades. I'm happening on private pl private planes. You know, the money that we're seeing today, like. They, they, them is like rap, like rap vibes to me, if you catch what I'm coming from. So that is the reason why we even, you know, say like, yeah, I'm a rapper. Like, so yeah, I mean, plenty of people understood, but some people, you know, is gonna, you know, fire over their head still. But yeah, that was that was the term was being used for. So there you have it, viewers and subscribers. Byron Messiah seemingly not considering himself still as a dancehall artist. He's more of a rapper as what he's saying, people. What Byron Messiah is saying is that because of the type of lifestyle that he's living, it's more of a rapper lifestyle than a dancehall artist lifestyle. Yeah? He might jump in an escalator, he might fly up on jet and them thing there. Everybody knows uh, in recent times, you know, a lot of pressure him come under, a lot of backlash for saying that he's not a dancehall artist even though he sings dancehall music whenever the charts are gonna place his music they're gonna place it under the reggae dancehall category but you can leave your thoughts about this in the comment section and tell me if you think you know Byron Messiah is a rapper or a dancehall artist tell them man up brand new UK day I must get man up send man up before the sun come up so now viewers and subscribers apparently skeng still want massacre dopey you know there's a leak audio circulating right now with skeng at this massacre in the worst way yo skeng no easy skeng is like the artist now nah, give up him still want this war one day if him get the clash if he would have take it to sting people <laughs> So 
So you know how Skeng go to work when it comes to gun lyrics people. It's like the man I say if you feel like him gun song them a Bible story. Yo, all a dance all coward, it come like a joke thing. So basically what Skeng has say is that Massacre a coward. Look how much time he must shoot off a Massacre, he must send in this track them a Massacre Nam. Give the artist the time of the day. Tell me if you think say, you know, Skeng deserve a response from Massacre. So Skeng has say Massacre no want to start it, you want who to start it, it seems like the Ratty Gang are ready to feed, you know, I'm ready for war, you know, Massacre right now and Skeng smart, you know, people because Skeng knows it as an upcoming artist, you know, the only way to get true fans and true recognition in this music is to go into a lyrical battle with the giants of dancehall and we see every young artist when them did that come up them did really want this and we see massacre did really want the clash when he was coming up just the same just like massacre him did a shoot off of alka him did a shoot off of idonia and them never did their pm no mind just the same so it's the same process with skeng right now skeng is at that point where my shoot off of the big artist because if him know say if him get a response and him clash them i win then film status I go elevate, everything I go up, in price I go, go up, you know, everything I go, go up, in double I go, go up, in bookings I go, go up, yo, Skeng I go reach up on that level. Even though eventually he will reach there, but if him enter in a clash and prove himself, then he go reach faster. And Skeng know how the game work, people. So that is the direct line where everybody knows eh, a massacre Skeng at all about, you know, you hear how Skeng mentioned the swamp in this one, who sing about swamp, who always has them a crocodile and crocodile living at the swamp, so, you know, Skeng not tap go off a massacre until him get a clash as well, I think. So people, Skeng tell we how corrupt him can be, him want book massacre red van and you know what time it is everybody knows that Massacre drive the red Porsche but tell me if you don't want to see this clash between Skeng and Massacre people it would be good for the culture and you know if them even can take it to Sting you know DJ and the same rhythm yo it would be a good look so leave your thoughts and opinion in the comment section about this <laughs> So now viewers and subscribers, we see where the Jamaican government gave a few people, you know, order of distinction for outstanding achievement, you know, persons like, you know, Marcia Griffiths, Wayne Marshall, Taurus Riley, and a lot of people have a lot of questions and you know, as to why, you know, Taurus Riley and Wayne Marshall got order of distinction. A lot of people think that them don't deserve it, you know, a lot of people think that especially Wayne Marshall don't deserve it. You know because him don't really have no major achievement in a music more than even the likes of a bunty killer or a beanie man we see where beanie man came on the media you know a lot of times and i say yo him think him deserve to get recognized you know something like that and his literally is like them spitting him face and give somebody below his level yeah people because even bunty killer truly deserving of that order of distinction I truly think that Beanie and Bunty Killer should have been recognized a long time ago, people. So, a lot of people say there is some type of politics when it comes to these type of things, or it's really the uptown um, type of people them give these type of awards. So, you know, Futa I basically I give him take on it and I say him want to know what are the requirements of you know persons getting order of distinction. Because if it is being a good dad, or you know, you know, portraying yourself in a good light which is what Wayne Marshall is doing you know a lot of people portray themselves in a good life and light and is a family man so why other persons can't get it who truly deserve it so I'm gonna run the video with Futile speaking I you tell me if you agree with him leave your thoughts down in the comment section yo remember saying me have to actually go on a rant and cuss Zin Fee them gee that woman here a real respect in them so me you want to know the criteria car based on all this are going on me glad for marshall car marshall an alliance like we are a one family and no matter how we branch off and do our own thing we are alliance but if marshall get out of distinction 
How bunting I get none? Remember, Bunty Killer bring Wayne Marshall to the forefront. And Bunty Killer is still active today. And Bunty Killer impact is, is unanimous. So I don't understand. Me want somebody explain the requirements of giving you order of distinction. What go on? I don't understand. I don't understand. Me, me, me understand. Taras a great artist too. I don't have no problem with him I get it. I don't have, not have no problem with Marshall getting it or Taras getting it. But I want to understand how the process go to decide who get out of distinction. Come me have me have questions. Me have questions. Me have serious questions. Me have serious question. Why? Right. Have to do with your address? It have to do. What, what have to do with? Me, me try to understand. Would I like somebody say? The requirement of giving somebody order of distinction is this and that and that and that and that. And let me look and see if me not have the requirement then, if B not have it, if Bunty not have it. You understand? When you check it out, you have to check if even Cartel not have it. You understand me, I say? But we know saying convicted and incarcerated, so that might play a role. But if I impact your talk about an influence and I'll volley more people forget about it then. I'll have instinction for your own volley more. It, 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 Jamaica, so, what? Jamaica want to read though. Jamaica want a redo. Jamaica want a redo. I'm actually glad to them give anti Marcia now. Because it, it was long overdue. But why would I have to cuss about it? This year, January, when um, Intimate Keep, you remember? Uh, after me, I reviewed the show, remember all my cuss? When I remember all my costs, when I remember all my costs, and say, then think you must say I respect and I something them. So who them are follow? 